the Dropkick Murphys shipped and are here to stay. Three sold out concerts at the MGM Music Hall culminating their St. Patrick's Day tour. Boston's uh, an Irish town and where else would you want to be for St. Patrick's Day? I've been to other places on St. Patrick's Day and it's nothing like Boston, you know. I'm from the best parade in the world to these shows. And that parade will come on the holiday itself. Streets will be packed and vendors are ready and hoping for sun. Well, that's the concern of Sunday. I'm not sure if it's going to rain, obviously. Ho hopefully not. There was millions of people last year. Like usual, Packies and Southie will close at 4, bars at 7. Parade organizers hoping everyone has a good time but stays safe. Come have fun, you know what? Be responsible and just respect the people around you and respect the neighborhood. Loco Taqueria and Oyster Bar is right on the parade route and serving up specials for the holiday. Our signature drink is a coconut margarita. Put a little green food coloring in it for the day. The security team here and at other bars across the neighborhood on the lookout for people spiking drinks. Boston police reminding people celebrating to protect yourself and your drink. If you didn't see it poured, don't drink it. Never leave a cup unattended. Avoid sharing them with others and use your hand to cover the rim if you're not looking at it. It's something we definitely talk to our security team about um, that they're prepped on just to keep an eye on. Now, police are also warning folks to be careful about rooftop and balcony viewing of the parade. It will go right behind me here on Broadway, which is going to be closed down for most of the day on Sunday. The parade kicks off at 1 o'clock.